Hey guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today, we're going to be building a boat that can probably get to the end, and everyone can build it. So, I'm going to head over to an uh, old account, and I'm going to show you how to get this, these blocks and how to get to the end every time with this simple glitch and a boat that will always get you to the end. So, let's get into it. So, I just got into my old account. We just need to wait for this thing to load. It might take a while because it's, you know, my old account, but once I'm getting in, like this, um, I can go over here, and so let's go to menu. So the first ship that I wanted to show you is basically with this, I'm at a best boat here. This is the best ship that you can have at the moment. It is pretty good in my opinion. Once you get enough gold, you can buy some more add-ons to this thing, but once you have this, you're pretty much set. I'll post another video later on how to build this, but this will almost get you to the end every time because of the blocks that you have right here. I'm going to show you how to get these, and all you really need to do is clear all your blocks like that. Now go over here to quests and start the soccer quest. As you can see, it has the check mark. I already did that. So what you're going to want to do, since you just started out the game, you're just, you're just going to have basically nothing. So you just place your wooden block right there. You don't need really anything for this thing. And you just place that, and it goes straight into the goal. I've done this several times, and it really does not do anything. And, okay. Go! And there we go. Oh, I just forgot that my volume's on, so let me turn that on. And there we go. I already completed the quest, so that I don't need to do it again, but there you go. So after you get all your blocks like that, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over here because you got 50 gold and buy a hinge. I already got a hinge because, you know, last video I tried to record didn't really work out. And there we go. And you need a new body type to use this glitch, so I'll be right back in a second and see you then. So now that I'm back in the game with my new character... It might look a little stupid because, you know, the hat going protruding in the middle of my head. But, so basically what you're going to want to do, get a chair. After you bought your hinge, it's going to be kind of easy to do this clutch. Just place your chair backwards. You don't need anything extra for this. So you just look down like this. And now you're just going to want to place a hinge right there. Turn it around and basically put it right there. And then we can do this. So look. We can do this, we can go up, down. This thing is harder to control because it's a normal hinge and there's really nothing you can do to control it except for just pushing backwards. Um, you're just gonna wanna turn, turn until you go to the go to the place. And this is kind of easy to do. It just requires 50 gold to make it. This is the cheapest glitch in this game. It's kind of easy to do. All you really need is a hinge and chair. So, yeah. Now, you basically just go to the end almost every time. Do not pass through the wall. So, you're just going to want to constantly go in, go on, go in, go in, and go out. So, basically, yeah. Now you just claim your 16 gold, and you just keep going. So, after you do that grinding cycle for a long time, you get 298 gold, like me in the corner right there. All you need to do now is you can buy the new best block in the game. Where is that thing? I can't see it. Um, you need, I think you need, yeah, you need 350. But for now, you can just buy the 50 of these blocks right here. And once you get pretty good at this game, you just buy those. Okay. And now, what you're going to want to do is place your blocks down in a row like this. A row of four. And then build a square, basically, like this. Okay, this might take a while for me. And then, there we go, almost got it. Once you build your square, like this, you're just going to want to fill it in like that, okay? Next step, what you're going to want to do is build two more blocks out like that, okay? Two more blocks out, and then you're going to want to go one, two, three, four, like that. One, two, three, four. And then you're going to want to just fill this spot in with this stone, but not in the middle. That's That doesn't come yet. Now what you're going to want to do is right about here, right in the middle point, you're just going to want to place four of these blocks right here and place a motor right about 
there, okay? This boat might seem a little complicated, but it will get you far. So now you're going to want to fill this in with the foil blocks you got from that soccer quest. And then there you go. So now you're just going to want to do this, this, this. Fill it in like that. Remember not to do anything to your engine because if you do, your engine will not do anything. Because if you don't know this, you basically can't do anything to your engine or it literally can't move. So yeah. Now you're just going to want to take your other blocks and then just put it over like that. And now just... You know, cover up your engine so that it's protected by a little foil. Because foil has three strengths, if I remember. Yep. So, it will do pretty well to protect your boat. And plus, you have a platform on top of it. So now you can place your chair there. But that will come later. Now you're just going to want to place your two blocks there. So now it's like Bed Wars, kind of. Because you're building a boat that kind of looks like a Bed Wars thing. So now, you're going to want to grab your chair, but not yet. And you're going to want to put, re basically put reinforcements of ice, because it also has three strength. So these are the most powerful blocks you have at the moment. And now you're just going to want to place those down like that. And boom, you're just going to want to place more of them down right here, right here. Just reinforcing your boat, basically. And yeah. So once you reinforced your boat, basically like this, now you can go all the way back down to your to your um, blocks like this, and then fill these tiny spaces in like that, right there, and then right there, right there, right there. Okay, so now you're just going to want to place them like this, and I'll take a screenshot later so that you can see how this boat finally turned out. And you can try to build this on your own, and if you do, leave a picture down in the comments. So, now, you have these blocks right here. What do you do with these, with these treasures? Y you don't start out with them, but once you get them, you can probably just put them in the front. So, this thing right here has a 5 strength, or 3 strength. This has 3 strength, so, so you're not going to want to put it like that. You're just going to want to put it right here, rotate it. And then put it right there. And then, where is my block? Okay, so I have one more. So I'm just going to place it, turn it, and then put it right here. So now we have reinforced. So now I can just open it. And, you know, it'll, it'll be kind of useful. And now, take your others. So you have, this one has a four strength. So you can put this one right here, and here, and here. So that it kind of gives you a protected space right there. And then the last one with the five strength right here, you can put right in the front to kind of like block some of the hits. Okay, so now, remember we had this chair? This is going to be right behind that, and you're just going to place some ice blocks right here, 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 and then place, um, don't, don't use your last two blocks, so then just, you know, place it, um, almost got it, so then here, here, and here. You're going to want to make it symmetrical so that it actually, you know, adds up and you can have a nice looking boat. So, then we can just put that right there. And boom, you have a good boat right there. You might want to move your chair because because if it's not symmetrical, your boat can fall over to the side or do something else. So now, you're going to want to come over here and save your slot. Okay? So this slot is going to be called Best Boat. Two. Best boat two. So then Bessie boat two. So then we just save slot and then you launch. So now that it's covered up, you can actually move with the engine covered up. And you can turn, you can do whatever you need. And your chest just fell off, but that doesn't really matter. Now you are going to travel pretty far with this boat. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit and basically you're gonna see how far this boat can go. Look. So if you look right there and for a millisecond, you can see that your engine is still moving and that I just almost died. So you're just going to want to keep going, keep going until you fall off of your chair or anything else, else terrible happens. And you're going to want to just try to use your controls to just dodge all these rocks. And I'll give an episode on steering. 
like a next episode because you know many people don't really know how to steer on mobile and it's pretty hard in my opinion because on computer it's much easier it's just arrow keys and yep yeah, i'm just going to speed it up in three two one go Avoid the train, that's my only piece of advice. So that's going to wrap it up for this video. Please remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and hit that notification bell to never miss another video. And we just got a lot of gold. We got to stage 7 with this boat. So if you can, just use this boat whenever you can. And it will be very useful if you're just trying to, you know, get to the end a lot. And, you know, see you next time.